Inspection and Test Plan ITP. ITP is also called Quality Control Plan QCP, but should not be mistaken with Project Quality Plan PQP. PQP is purely a quality assurance exercise and tell you how the quality measures are planned for each topic such as contract review, procurement, storage, non-conformity, design, training, etc. While ITP is list of QC activities designed to ensure quality requirements are met. Although design of ITP is a quality assurance exercise but the implementation of ITP is purely a QC exercise. Quality control activities mentioned within ITP are designed to demonstrate that the product has met the requirements. Inspection and test plan is the bridge between quality assurance and quality control activities. Other information within an inspection and test plan includes Name and tag number of equipment Reference codes Reference procedures Acceptance criteria QC procedures Verifying documents such as records and reports. ITP is solely focused on the product manufacturing and the type of tests required at each phase. How the test is done, QC procedure. How the test result is accepted, by comparing the test result against an acceptance criteria taken from specification or construction code. Intervention points of relevant parties, subcontractor, contractor, client, third-party inspection, TPI, and authorized inspection, AI. And their status such as Hold activity, H Witness activity, W Monitor activity, M Review document, R Approve document, A the supplier cannot proceed if the client's inspector or representative has not attended the hold intervention point. On the other hand, the supplier can proceed if the client's inspector or representative has not attended the witness intervention point. Therefore, hold points is assigned for the most critical QC activities while witness intervention points are less important. Monitor point does not need inspection notification and client's inspector that may or may not carry surveillance during those particular activity.